Oh, hi. I didn't see you there. So Dragon Ball Fighter Z is out. And there's been a lot of hype and speculation regarding the eight upcoming DLC characters. So I figured, why not add to that speculation by making a list of five characters that won't appear in Dragon Ball Fighter Z? Because I love angry comments. Feel free to leave any below telling me how wrong I am and how Omega Shenron will definitely be in the game. Because he is the strongest one, so... Number five, Dragon Ball villains. Now, this one seems pretty obvious, but I've seen a lot of people speculating that King Piccolo or Mercenary Tower will make a surprise appearance, and I, 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 don't, I don't think so. One, they're not even close to being as powerful as Blooper Saiyan Goku and friends, and two, they're just not relevant anymore. Like seriously, when was the last time you genuinely thought about Mercenary Tower, like as a friend? Exactly, like he doesn't think of you, you don't think of him, okay? You've moved on, you've got, you know, you've moved on to Jiren. You guys, with Jiren now, he's got a really good personality, so I look a bit like him actually. <laughs> you know, I'm more muscular. Number four, Goten and Trunks individually. When was the last time Goten and Trunks did something? Did something of any kind of relevance, outside of being Gotenks. I think they punched a snake for some water. Remember that? Because I barely remembered it. Goten and Trunks are just not interesting. We have far more interesting versions of those characters in Goku and Future Trunks. I think their diminutive heights and lack of any real relevance since the Boo Saga in Z is going to keep them from being playable in any way, shape or form. And honestly, I'd rather play as adult Trunks anyway. Young Trunks is a snot-nosed piece of shit. I was really glad when Vegeta punched him in the face. Number three, the Universe 6 Saiyans. Ooh, now we're getting contentious. No one cares about Goten and Trunks, but everyone seems to like Cabo, Cauliflower, and Kale. Well, they like Cauliflower from the internet searches I've been conducting. Kale and Cauliflower have the prestigious honor of being the first female Super Saiyans ever created, and that pissed a lot of people off. Like, a lot of people. Plus, Kale's legendary Super Saiyan form is a palette swap of Broly. And I think if they were going to put Kale or Broly in the game, they're going to put Broly in because Broly is far more popular. The only character I can see getting in out of the three Saiyans is Kaba. And he is the most boring of the lot. He has no personality. He's a skinny armed, weak little <laughs> Saiyan whose playstyle would be very similar to Team Gohan's. So why not just leave it at Team Gohan? Like, don't, don't get me wrong, I do like the Universe 6 Saiyans. Cauliflower Kali is my bae. But I think they're going to want to diversify the character roster a bit more. So far, we have... What? Let me look. I mean, as far as Super Saiyans go, we already have Goku and Vegeta in both Super and Blooper Saiyan forms, Young and Adult Gohan, Gotenks, Future Trunks, and Goku Black. If Broly makes it in, that's a total of 10 playable Saiyan characters. If... Bardock makes it in, that's 11. Will they make it 12? Hopefully not, but if they do, I hope they put in... I've closed my phone, that's my script. <laughs> if they do put in a Universe 6 Saiyan, I hope it's Cauliflower, because she is the most fun of the three, and also her name sounds like Cauliflower. Number two, Zamas, or Zamasu. Oh, oh, this is, this is, whew. Of course they're gonna put Zamasu in, the green-skinned, ningen-shouting dude who hates mortals and he wants to wipe them from existence. The issue I see with him is that he's basically going to be a palette swap of Goku Black because they are the same person. The best thing they could do is make him an alternate costume for Goku Black. Also, he's immortal, so how would that play into the game? I don't know, they're doing a lot of things with clones. I don't really know much about the game at this point. This is the one pick that I am the least certain about. That's why I made him number two because they seem to be doing all the, all the villains from Z onwards. So there's a good chance he'll be in, but I kind of hope he's not, because he's a bit crap. <laughs> if they do put him in, he'll probably just have Goku Black's moveset. Or not. I'm not the authority on this, so... Number one, Gogeta. Oh! Oh, what? Yes, Gogeta. But, I hear you say, he is the strongest guy. He went Super Saiyan 4 and he, he messed up Omega Shenron. Yes, but he's not canon. And if you were going to put either Gogeta or Vegito in, you would probably put Vegito in because Vegito's appeared in the show twice and has a blue form. Uh, Gogeta doesn't. 
Oh, what about that Universal theme park ride? No, that's not Gogeta because Goku fuses with the audience. So, ha, huh, check and mate. I love Gogeta. I think Gogeta's fantastic. I think he's really cool and he's like, uh, uh, but he probably won't go in because they seem to be trying to push for canon stuff more than non-canon stuff. We've just had the Tournament of Power and there are a lot of characters there to choose from. I mean, think about it. Who's more likely to be in? Basil from the Trio de Danger or Gogeta? Probably Gogeta, you know, I, yep, good point, bad example, but I still don't think he'll be in it. In fact, I'm going to stake my reputation on Gogeta not appearing in the game. Ha! Joke's on you! I don't have a reputation outside of being a dickhead. I don't know, I just, fusion characters don't really interest me, I think they're a bit boring, so... So there's my list of five characters that won't appear in Dragon Ball Fighter Z. Did you hate it? Make sure to leave a dislike and leave an angry comment below telling me how wrong I am. I also made a list on four characters that will definitely appear in Dragon Ball Fighter Z, and I discussed the speculation regarding some other different characters that have been leaked. So check that out. Stay beautiful. I love you all. And sweet dreams.